What's up champs? Welcome to today's video. My name is Trevin Peterson and in today's video we're going to be doing a day in the life of an Amazon seller. Here we go just waking up for the day. As you can see I was wearing a face mask as my eye mask and since I got LASIK that's what I've been doing and it's been working amazing. So I highly recommend wearing a face mask when you sleep. Um, it's nine o'clock and basically the first thing that I do when I get up is since I got LASIK I need to put in my eye drops so Let's get these eye drops and let's put these bad boys in. All right, so let's put in the eye drops. I have to put these in every single hour. A lot of people are asking me about how the LASIK experience was. It was amazing. It was a trippy surgery procedure, um, but I had now have 2015 vision. These are artificial tears, so they make my eyes super watery. But anyways, after I put these in, um, I like putting on my blue light glasses just uh, so my eyes aren't super sensitive to uh, my computer. And then I uh, grab my computer and I open it up and I start uh, responding to the most important notifications, emails, Facebook groups, um, check on my Amazon business, check on just all important notifications. And once I do that, I then go um, eat breakfast. All right, so here we are inside my screen. I'm checking on the, the private student Facebook group. So I got some member requests from over the weekend. I uploaded the student live so they can click on that link to watch the student live that happened on Saturday. I'm right here, I'm looking at some warehouses and hopefully we're gonna go look at some today. I'm not entirely sure if they're going to be available or not, um, but I am looking to expand and, and grow um, in that sense. So I'm excited about that, trying to find some space. It's very difficult. Um, so hopefully I can show you some of those spaces today. I'm um, checking out my BitClout. Um, I have 58 followers now and my coin is worth $69. It was 123 yesterday and completely tanked. Um, so I got that done. I responded to some emails. I got uh, some responses to some DMs. Got ready for some content that I'm gonna post on Instagram and TikTok today. And it is now 9.55, so it took me about an hour to do everything right there. And now we're gonna go um, eat some breakfast. All right, so I threw on a new hat. I actually got this uh, on Saturday, it went golfing, so that felt great to get out. It's uh, an amazing day out. We'll go out on the balcony, but we're in the kitchen and we're gonna eat some breakfast real quick. And uh, honestly, we don't have much. Um, as you can see in our fridge, I door dash, and I hate to say this, probably either at least once a day, if not two times a day, each meal. So right here, we're gonna do some peanut butter toast and honey. We'll get that cooking. We'll go out on the balcony, show you guys the view and um, eat some breakfast. But as you can see, this is the view that we got, so. Um, it's beautiful. It's a little chilly. If not, I would eat out right there, but we'll stay inside for today. And I'm not sure what she's doing on the ground. <laughs> she's stretching. Zara, give her some love. But hopefully this toast finishes up and cooks nicely. All right, so we got the peanut butter toast. She's making an acai bowl, which is better than this, but that's all right. She didn't want her food. She wants this. So can you do a trick, Zara? Sit pretty. Good girl, stay. Get it, get it. Good girl. <laughs> She's a funny dog. All right, so now we're upstairs in my old studio. We just wrapped up breakfast and I sold a few basketball cards over the weekend, so I need to get those shipped out. I sold these two together. I sold that uh, by itself and then this one sold for $1,900. So as you can see, um, I'm addicted to this hobby. This is like a couple thousand dollars worth of cards that I opened, as you can see all the trash there. Um, and then I have all of that. And then I have all of these cards that are graded and I have thousands and thousands of dollars worth of cards now, but it's been super fun. Anyways, that's that. We'll get those packed up. And then I also have a few Amazon shipments. All right, so it's 1030 now and I got some boxes that I need to send into Amazon. So I'm going to send in those. And I also got these over here, but that's the main reason that I want to get um, an office space. Actually, I should say a warehouse space. I have an office space, but the issue with the office space is I send the inventory here first and then I get my truck loaded up and then, and then I take it to the office space. I can't just ship it directly to the office space because um, it's being used by somebody else. Um, I'm renting out the top part of the building and so it's been a complete pain. It's worked really well, don't get me wrong, but I wanna get a place where I can literally just send all my shipments directly to the warehouse. They can open up the garage and then just store them. And so that's the goal. Hopefully I can show you guys some warehouses that I'm looking at today, but we're gonna go pack up the, the basketball cards. We're gonna print the labels for, I'm probably gonna be sending in probably 
three or two of those boxes. I'm not 100% sure, but we'll go print those labels right now. All right, so we're gonna ship out these cards. I got the Roadcaster Pro, which maybe we'll set up later today. It's for my studio downstairs to just improve the sound quality. People I know are gonna ask me, hey, why, if you're doing FBA, why are you having the boxes in your garage or why are you getting a warehouse? Are you doing FBM? And no, I'm doing 100% FBA. It's just a way for me to manage my inventory so I don't run out of stock. A lot of times my manufacturers have long lead times and by the time I order and replenish that inventory, there's like a three week period where sometimes I run out of stock. And so I'm just trying to do everything and anything to avoid running out of stock because that's the worst thing that can happen. Because in those three weeks of me being out of stock, that's thousands and thousands of dollars in lost potential profit. And so with that uh, potential thousands and thousands of dollars I'm gonna go get a warehouse space send more inventory there store it and then when I need it I can trickle it into Amazon so I know I've talked about that but that is the reasoning behind it all right so that meeting went a little longer than I had hoped but I got all the shipments prepped I got two boxes from over there two from right here um, got them loaded up in the truck wish we could take the Tesla but it doesn't fit so we got them all loaded up in here. We're gonna head to the office now. And I have like two more shipments that I'm gonna grab there. And hopefully um, where the office is at, there's a warehouse that I'm interested in looking at. There's actually two and I'm hoping I can look at them. Then if not, um, hopefully later today or if not tomorrow, um, I'll for sure throw in a clip of those warehouses um, once I edit the video. But we're gonna go to the office, get some shipments, drop these off at the UPS store, go to lunch, and then we're gonna go to the golf store and get her some golf clubs. So <laughs> we'll see you guys there. All right, so we just got to the office. And as you guys can see, it is a disaster. I have boxes everywhere. My brother's doing some of his retail arbitrage stuff. And the issue with this place is it's upstairs through those windows right there. It looks down into a warehouse space, but it's being used. And so we can't even use that space. And so all of these boxes, we had to carry up the stairs. And so if I need to go ship them, it's kind of a pain that I have to carry them down the stairs. Um, so I wanna get a space with a big overhead door. Um, it would be shared between me, my brother, and then my business partner. Um, and so we're looking to get a warehouse. And so we're gonna actually go look through uh, that space. I'm here shortly. Um, they're on their way uh, to come look at it, but we're gonna get a few shipments packed up. We got two of them right there, those big Amazon boxes. Um, and then she's doing some returns of, I don't know, she bought some jeans or something. So she's returning those. So we're gonna go to the UPS store. We got food delivered here. We're gonna eat and then we're gonna go look at the warehouse. So we got a lot of stuff going today. It's been a busy day. It is, what time is it? It is one o'clock. So uh, as you can see, it's just go, 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 go constantly. And that's what's fun is it's something different every day. I'm not always sending in shipments. I'm not always looking at warehouses. I don't always have super long uh, meetings like I did earlier today, but something is always different every single day. And that's what I love about my job. So um, I'm gonna get these shipments done and then uh, I'm not sure we'll, where we'll end up, whether we're eating or at the warehouse, but we'll see you soon. All right, so this is from up top, um, big warehouse space down below, as you can see. And obviously they'll be out here shortly, but this is a big old warehouse and then the space upstairs and then office space in the front. All right, so here is the next warehouse that we're looking at. We got an office space here, a little closet, come down the stairs. And if I add cars to the collection, I can have a space for it. Okay, so I got that loaded up and the entire back is loaded up. So I got a lot more boxes than I thought that I would have. But now we're gonna go to the golf store and get my wife a pair of clubs and then my friend right there my, and my business partner. Um, he's gonna get a set of clubs for his wife as well. So we're gonna head over to the store and it should be fun. Okay, so we found a set of clubs right here and she, she says she doesn't like them because they're blue. They're perfect, but they're not blue. Why don't you like them? They're just not cute. They're not cute enough for her, so I might have to go online <laughs> no, and find a different set, even though these would be like the perfect ideal beginner okay. set. Uh, so they're getting out matching outfits. I'm getting something, but what do you think, Sid? How does it look? Good, now I need to get a white skirt. A white skirt to match? But probably from Lulu. 
I, I got <laughs> Gosh, <laughs> this so is not funny. good for our wallets, but we're having fun. <laughs> All right, show, show me your matching outfits. What did you guys get? They got pink, pink tees, and then they got matching shirts, and then they got pink golf balls and matching gloves. There you go, you guys are decked out. You guys are ready to go. <laughs> All right, so they're off to pickleball lessons, and we're gonna go to Shields and see if we can find some clubs that she likes. So they have to be a certain color. So that's what we're gonna do next, and then we'll drop off all the boxes at the UPS store. All right, so we just got done with the shipments, and she wants to go outside and play fetch. So we're gonna go out there and play fetch for a sec. Hopefully she doesn't go chase the neighbors. And I got some actually lights that just got delivered for the studio. But it's a beautiful day out. So here's our circle. Here's the house. If you guys wanna watch the full house tour, it's on the channel. Sorry, where's the ball? Look at the ball. Come here. All right, so we just got done playing fetch with her. She's super tired now, but I'm gonna respond to some more messages on the Facebook group. And then I also have some emails um, that I need to catch up on. And then I'm gonna continue looking for warehouses, seeing if ever, anything comes up. And then right here, I have a lot of emails, 1638553, um, quite a bit. And then of course, I'm gonna do some shopping on Built. Um, they're having a sale going on right now and then I need to get some new shorts. I might get a new pair of their shoes that I really like as well. So I'm gonna do that as well. All right, so I just got done looking at Built stuff and they have some sale going on and I think I found some stuff. Don't think I got enough, but I got a new pair of shorts, two pairs of shorts, and then a few new t-shirts. This is a Built shirt, by the way. And if you guys haven't shopped on Built, this is not sponsored by Built, but it's gonna be about 300 bucks, but that's a lot. I mean, we're getting quite a bit of stuff. Um, the shorts are the most expensive part. Um, and then I'm sure after the discount, um, it'll be cheaper. So we'll go check out and see. Um, so I got 14 minutes to check out, but as you can see, I got some rewards because I shop here so much. So I'll apply that. And then they might have a discount code. Where is it at? Let me come back. Oh, save 20. Look at that. It popped up. Up. save 20 apply that and then I get this down to $213 so built is amazing it's great um, then I'm gonna check out and we should be good to go all right so the girls just got back from pickleball practice how was it good. give me a rundown what did you do That's a day in the life right there. I hope you guys are enjoying the video. We're probably gonna go to lunch, or dinner I should say. It's now 5.40, and hopefully I can get a quick workout in later tonight as well, but that is our life right there. Get me to be able to tag. Don't. Boom. Can you do that for me? Zero to 60 and a 30 right there. On the way to dinner right now, we're gonna go to Red Fuego. Um, it's a Peruvian restaurant. It's one of my favorite places ever. And this is why I love where I live. As you guys can see, it's just beautiful. It's a, it's a great day out. But you can see the mountains. I don't know if you can kind of see it right now. The trees are in the way. But we got the mountains in our backyards. And it's just beautiful. All right, so here's the food. It's called uh, Lomo Saltado, and it is amazing, as you can see. We all got it, and then there's some good sauce. So it's french fries, steak, um, stirred vegetables, and then rice. What do you think, Sid? 
Alright, so we just got done with Red Fuego and now we're going to a place called Crumble to get some cookies. Alright, so here are the cookie options and we're gonna get a four pack. What are we getting? A Funfetti, chilled sugar, chocolate chip, and a Biscoff. There we go, so we add that to bag. And then we check out. Oh, you, you can't do that. You did no tip. You gotta go back. That was mean. You always gotta, you gotta always give back. There you go. And then we gotta swipe the card. All right, here's the final reveal. There we go. I keep trying to eat healthy, but they always want cookies, and so I'm gonna have to do a workout tonight. Don't know if I'll film it, but it's been a great day so far. I hope you guys have enjoyed. It's beautiful, it is a little windy, America. It's the flag, the American flag. America, I was pointing to the flag. Subscribe if you guys have enjoyed, like the video, drop a comment. If you guys want more of these videos, let me know. And we are home, just pulling into the driveway. We're probably gonna go take our dog for a walk. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Today's been a great day. Very eventful, very productive day. What do you think, Sid? It's been good. She doesn't like being on, on camera, but that's all right. And there you have it. That is the end of today's video. A day in the life of an Amazon seller, or I should say a day in the life of a serial entrepreneur. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed and uh, some of the insights and just got to see some things that I like to do um, and some things that I do on a daily basis. So we're gonna basically wrap up today. It's uh, 7.30. I'm going to take my dog on a walk and then we're gonna go, um, I'm gonna work out. So I got the gym down here and after that shower clean up get in bed work a little bit more watch some tv and just enjoy the rest of the night and then we'll go to bed probably around one o'clock ish i have to talk to some suppliers and then i'll wake up again and repeat the process um every day is different um tomorrow i'll probably film another youtube video um hopefully look at some more warehouses but i hope you guys enjoyed the inside look and then this is my studio so this is where i normally film my youtube videos but today was uh, special and i had fun um, documenting the entire day and if you guys enjoyed and want to see more videos like it let me know i um, mean if you guys want to learn how to sell on amazon as well i have a completely um step-by-step -step a to z program taking you through the entire process it's amzchampions.com. I'll put the link down below. I'd love to have you in as a student and I'd love to show you how to sell on Amazon um, and turn your dreams into a reality. So again, I hope you enjoyed and we'll see you in the next video.